Hello and welcome to another episode of Tammy Power Gaming. In this episode we will be continuing my rare draft with my black white deck and that starts right now. Power Gaming! Power Gaming! Okay, so here we go. Um, yeah, that's a keeper for hand. Uh, so play a planes. Play my falcon. Pass the turn. Okay. Got a little haste creature there. Shouldn't be too much of a problem. Play my swamp. Attack for one. At this point, uh, we can play my wall. Just give me a little reach. Uh, an artifact. A uh, little threat of uh, damage. Uh, we've got an enchantment. Uh, more damage coming, uh, luckily for us. Uh, just need to draw into some removal, and we'll just keep the pressure on. Uh, hopefully we can race him a little bit with this. So. Okay, no, not too bad, uh, just as long as it looks like he put the enchantment on the wrong creature at this point, so. Mm, a little bit more life gain. Uh, so we're actually hoping to draw into uh, some removal at this point. Uh, we have a little bit of removal. Um, cavalry should actually give us a nice threat to stave off the 4 4. Attack one. Uh, so he's need takes out my flyer that's that's okay uh, yeah we'll, we'll block Let's give a half a card for a card not not a bad trade at all at this point uh yeah let's uh let's put a little bit of a uh, bigger threat on the board for him let's see what he does yeah it looks like he he wants to to trade at this point. But we're not going to give him the option and we draw into the removal so that's what I like about the revitalize if I can uh, get it with uh, my removal I can actually take out some bigger creatures also uh, with uh, my life gain payoff on the board it helps uh, out even more. We can get two extra points in and Create a two for one for his uh, card. Not to mention, get two extra points and be able to swing in for uh, some good damage at this point. Not to mention, we've got a, another life gainer on the board. Let's see what uh, is. doesn't seem to be doing much yet. And we'll a little bit of an artifact. Uh, uh, at this point, we should probably keep this in our hand, but you know, I think we're going to actually play this one. So let's let's put this out. Should I actually wait until uh, after this to to put put a threat out, but uh, we'll, we'll just go from here. Uh, Oh, I'll move into our combat phase. I'm sorry, I had a little, little something go on there. We'll be, we'll be conservative. I, I don't want him to take out my 4-4 uh, payoff or life gain at this point. We'll gain a life and deal a point of damage. That's the turn. So at this point it looks like a, we've got a pretty good clock on him. We're actually going to deal another point of damage before the turn's up. Bane fire. Now I should have actually uh, hit him for some damage here, but uh, for some reason I waited till the end of the turn. Actually, got. She should be down to five, but uh, 
Oh well. And it's, it's actually something I should have done last turn. But hindsight. So take out his creature this time. Still allows us to hit him for one and gain some life. Oh, I forgot to do that. He should actually be down to four at this point. So you use your error on that one. Uh, so we're, we'll attack in for three. If he's got any any threats or anything to answer it, if not, uh, he's on a pretty short clock. Uh, Root snare. Uh, so he fogs us. Uh, it's not, not not too bad. Uh, so there's a one three attaches the equipment. Uh, not not much there. We seem to be uh, flooding on the lands at this point. So we will attack for one. Yeah, we'll attack with all of them. There's no real reason not to. Down to four, which he should technically be down to two at this point, but... We should put him at one, which would kill him, but uh, we're in such a good position that it really doesn't matter at this point unless he has an answer to the threats. He's uh, pretty much dead on the next turn, so... Our child of night, just to keep the threats up. There he goes. Uh, he saw the end coming. So it's uh, the first win. Oh, one and O. Oh. So far, so good. Even with a couple misplays on my part. So here's second game. Uh, not the most spectacular hand, but I'm going to keep it. Uh, it kind of gives me a little bit of uh, early game, but you know, hopefully we draw into some threats at this point. And we have a double double mulligan with a scry to the bottom. That's, a, that's actually a good sign. So we'll play our wall. That's the turn. He plays a land. That's get a, a, another land and play our other wall. Pass the turn. Yep, no, no real threats. Hey, we got our our big removal. We could have actually uh, played an untapped. But yeah, actually no reason to. So hit up for one before turn, gain the life. We'll play our Falcon at this point, pass the turn. And here we go, we got, we got something that we probably should take care of. We'll hit him for one before a turn, gain a life. Okay, so we'll just make him unblockable instead of actually getting rid of the creature. So we can uh, reserve ourselves for any other threats. Maybe something bigger will come out that we can uh, destroy, but we'll, we will see. This way we still have the ability to deal them a point of damage and gain life if needed. So we have a take vengeance, so he's, he's taking it out of our hands whether or not we can do that. So we'll deal a point, gain a life, take our turn, and at this point we should just get rid of the threat. Uh, into some removal. Okay, let's get rid of the spider so we can keep the pressure on. And we will attack with our falcon and pass the turn. anything really big so we'll block with the zero three just see if he's got anything and yeah a little, little bit of bite we'll we'll do we'll take it we'll deal a point gain life uh, at this point let's just play our pegasus after we attack and pass the turn So 
Oh yeah, well, we're far enough ahead where we can just sit there and take the damage at this point. So nothing really big. Uh, we'll swing her in for two. And yeah, pass the turn at that point. I think he's thinking about it, but... Uh, <coughs> Well, plummet. Okay, not, not too bad. We're still doing pretty good within the life area. Oh, we get a threat there. And we seem to be flooding out at this point. So still, we'll still keep on the aggro, but uh, not looking good for the home team at the, this point. And spider. Okay, so, you know, play our threat, but it's not really going to do anything uh, at this point past the turn. Mm. Uh, regrew is plummet. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna concede this and move on to the next match. So, at this point, we are one to one. Um, so, yeah, not too bad of a start. Uh, one win, one loss. Uh, in order to keep these videos a little bit shorter, uh, we're actually gonna move on to the end of this video and. Uh, We'll continue it uh, later on. Uh, as always, uh, there's a link to the Patreon page down below. Uh, also, the Robinhood app. Uh, as always, thanks for watching and have a great day.